<laughs> uh, but I can tell you what is going on outside, and that is that we have had a cold and rather snowy day in Northeast Ohio. Uh, George Pajamas, as we call him, George Pajamas, <laughs> I get it mixed up every time. Our videographer is out and about. Obviously, he is downtown Cleveland on Lakeside Avenue, aiming west right at 9th Street, just down the street from us here. And yeah, we're still getting some light snow showers that are coming down across the area. Not too bad out there. The roads were a little slushy in spots. Matt Standridge is in for Matt Wentz today. And Matt, when does this round of snow move out? Hey, it's good to see you, Betsy. This snow is going to kind of linger on and off across the area for at least the next 24 hours or so. We had some heavier bands a little bit earlier this afternoon. We're starting to see some weakening though over time. Here's a loop over the past six hours. We got hit with some light to moderate snow throughout the morning time frame, especially close to the lake shore. We had a little bit of break early in the afternoon, and then right now we're starting to watch some more redevelopment at this hour. Some light snow out there reporting anywhere from Lakewood right along the lake shore to downtown Cleveland and Menor on the lake as well. This is actually looking at the, the radar estimating how much snowfall we've gotten over the past 12 hours. And you can see the majority of it has been within 30 to 40 miles of the lakeshore. So we'll still watch for more scattered snow showers, not just tonight, but maybe even lingering into the tomorrow and maybe even the first part of the weekend as this low pressure system continues to sit over the Great Lakes. So temperatures dropping this evening. However, looking towards next week, a big warm up may be on the way. We're going to detail that for you coming up.